My husband Preston and I have a new baby for 72 hours in Minecraft. <sighs> okay, where is my doctor? When is he gonna get here? I mean, I am ready to see this Minecraft child. Wait, Preston, what are you doing here? What are you doing in scrubs? Bree, 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 whoa, I totally got this. Preston, got what? You are not a doctor. You did not go to medical school. I do not trust you with delivering a Minecraft child. I'm a professional Minecrafter, so I am perfect for the job. Can't you see I'm in real doctor clothes? Preston, being a professional Minecrafter and a professional doctor are very different things. And you can get scrubs at the store. Now go on. I'm going to call a real doctor in here. Preston is such a mess sometimes. Oh, so cute. He looks so derpy. He definitely took after you. Oh, you know what, Preston? I'm offended by that. That's not true at all. I think he's pretty cute. Is it a boy or a girl? He has pink bedding. Y'all, I can't tell if this baby's a boy or a girl. He, she is hungry, and I don't know what to do. And before I feed him, I have to name him. So... Comment down below what you think I should name him. I'm going to name him Jerry. Y'all let me know what you think I should name him. Preston, Brianna, Jerry, PB and J. I'm trying here. Do we have a fridge in this house? We've got to, right? I mean, we have buttons here. What does this do? Oh, it opened a fridge. Let's go see. Cold milk bottle. Do babies like cold milk? I don't know. I don't have one. I just feel like it needs to be warm, right? Everybody knows that. It's like more comforting. I have a perfect idea. I have warm water in my sink. It's a cauldron. I'm going to toss the bottle in there. That was convenient. It just went pop and went back in my inventory so conveniently. I have a warm milk bottle. For those of you at home, now you know you just go to the fridge and throw it in the sink. I think I'm ready to feed my child and I'm excited about it. Here you go, Cherry. Goo ga. That means he's happy, right? Yay! Oh, Cherry. Do, 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 do. Wait, it is wah, wah, wah in my chat. That sounds like a very large bird, but it is actually Jerry. I just fed you. Jerry, I just fed you. I'm gonna dance. Be happy, I'm dancing. Jerry is not intrigued by my dancing ability. La, la, la. Babies like singing. Jerry, do you like my singing? My child doesn't like me. Um, do you want more milk? Um, ah! Oh no, there is no more milk in this house. I'm going to have to go to the store. Um, Jerry? Garth, is my child levitating or am I holding him? Guys, what is happening? I'm sorry, but I'm like really freaked out. Ah! Okay, he's falling asleep, but he lost his eyeballs in the process. I think this is a good thing. Is he drooling? Let's take a moment and appreciate this. Oh, baby Jerry. La la la, baby Jerry, he's rocking with me. This is hilarious, but it's not. This is a serious moment. I'm rocking my child to sleep, okay? He's so enjoying this that he's drooling all over himself. You know what? Maybe he shouldn't hover for too long. Maybe I should put him back in the bed. Wait, why would you wake back up? Jerry, oh, his eyeballs are back. <gasps> okay, Jerry is waking up. He's moving a lot. You know what that means? He is very advanced. He is already wanting to dance, and I think that means he wants a toy. Dancing means excitement, which means toy. I wanna go to the toy store and see what all new toys there are. Let's go, Jerry. It really looks like I'm gonna drop you and I'm gonna cry if that happens. I really need a stroller, Jerry. That'll be our first investment at the toy store. This is making me very nervous. This is going to be one of the most magical moments of your entire life. I don't know if you can see it very well because you're kind of swaying a lot and you're, you're not really making eye contact with the store. Jerry, come on, focus. Is this a real live fish? Jerry, do you need a pet yet? Are you too young for pets? You're, you're too young for responsibilities. It's fine. There's a dollhouse, there's a tiger, there's a bumblebee. Jerry, what toy do you want for your first toy? It's a big deal. Oh, there's an upstairs even? There's no toys upstairs, Jerry. I think this is employees only and I took you. I'm making you break rules at age one. Not even one year. This is not good. Jerry, you want the pay? <gasps> Jerry, come back. Oh, Jerry, come back. Okay. Ah, I keep losing Jerry. We have to decide on what toy we are going to get you for your first toy. I say pig. <gasps> Huzzah. 
Jerry, are you excited? You have a toy pig. That the toy you want, ma'am? You know what, shopkeeper? You sound a little judgmental. I mean, I'm just gonna be honest because of the tone. That tone sounds a little... She's like, are you sure? I am sure, ma'am. I don't think I spelled that right, but I meant ma'am. Good choice. Thank you for the affirmation. That will be $5. I don't know if I have $5. Jerry, hey, do you have $5? I'm kidding. I'm, I'm kidding. I'll take care of it, Jerry. I've, I've totally prepared for this moment. Hey, Jerry, you're gonna have to go back to bed. It's been a long day. You picked a pig and that just took a lot of energy out of you. But you know what, Jerry? I'm gonna put the pig very close by. He can watch after you while you take a nap. What are we gonna name him? Hammy? Hammy will watch you while you take a nap. Your baby is growing up. It's been like two days. Jerry, you have superpowers. It was Hammy. <gasps> oh, you're a toddler. You're really cute. Preston is missing this moment. You have started walking in like two days. Your toddler has taken his first steps. Yes, you have taken after your mom. It was a compliment all along. Jerry is very advanced. Just for this, Jerry, you deserve a treat. I'm gonna take you to the bakery. Also, can I point out where's Preston? He has been gone for all of these big moments. Also, he's gonna miss getting a cookie. He loves cookies. We're gonna go to the bakery. Let's go. Jerry, are you following me? Can you go up steps already? Jerry is a very advanced baby. Hi, baker. Hi, welcome to my bakery. What a cute little man you have there. How about I give you a pastry on the house? Choose anything you want behind me. Jerry, if I take you anywhere, you're so cute, I get free stuff. I wish I was that cute. What do you want for your first pastry? What was that? Cake? Good choice. I like to bake and I like to bake cake. Can we have cake, please? Preston is gonna be so jealous. We have the best cakes in the city. Here you go. Here you go. I like her sass. Jerry, can you eat this? You don't have teeth yet. Is it safe to give you cake? Oh, he went for it. So I guess he's fine. We'll find out later, unfortunately. So it's been a while since we went to the bakery and I am personally not doing okay because ever since Jerry had his first bit of cake, he now has superpowers from all the sugar and um, Hamlet has been talking to him a lot. Can't find Jerry anywhere. He walked somewhere. He is now able to walk and I can't find my toddler anywhere. He's not in the fridge, which is probably where I would be hiding. He is not in his crib. He is, hmm, he's not upstairs, I don't think. Should have checked here sooner. Um, no, he's not upstairs. Oh my goodness, he's not in the purple room with these cool square things. Oh my gosh, there's so many places he could be hiding and I'm freaking out. Literally, I turned around for two seconds. I thought I was responsible, way more responsible than Preston, and then this happened. He's never gonna let me live this down, y'all. It's gonna be so bad. Mama, help me? Guys, look on the roof. Jerry got on the roof. Not only am I concerned to the point that I want to cry right now, but Jerry somehow, at age zero seconds, was able to get on top of the roof. Does he fly? Did he repel? I don't think I'm gonna be able to get on top of the roof. Jerry is more agile than me. How am I gonna figure this out? Oh no. Are there parkour blocks over here? This is not gonna end well for me. Jerry, why did you have to do this to me? You're gonna age me fast. Looks like he's levitating. Do this, even if it takes me 20 years. It's for the sake of Jerry. I'm gonna save Jerry. I'm coming for you, Jerry. It's like Tom and Jerry. I am the mouse. He would be the mouse because he's a lot smaller than me. I'm the cat and he's the mouse. Typically, they don't like each other, but in this situation, we love each other. Oh, I don't know where to jump from here. Jerry, this could be a bad situation, but I'm gonna figure it out. Ah, Jerry, I've got you. I don't know what I'm doing. <gasps> I landed on the block I never thought I would land on and I can even see. Oh no, I'm getting distracted. Please. Don't move. Oh, hey, I'm king of the rock. I just have to make it right here and then I'm almost to the roof, Jerry. I can do this. Three, two, nope, I'm not ready. Ah! Whoo! Hot doggies! Hot doggies! Hey, Jerry, come to mama. You know how to walk. You can do this. He loves me? Love mommy? I know. I did basically sacrifice my life to get up here to you. It was worth it. 
I love you, Derry. Now let's work on getting you down. It's a long way. Let's not look down. Ooh, now I'm nervous. Preston and I have had twins in Minecraft and oh my goodness, they're so cute. But wait, we named them Baby Preston 1 and Baby Preston 2 and there's Preston. How am I gonna keep their names straight? They're the same thing. Hi, little baby Preston. I feel like these babies should have cribs, but they literally have like king size beds. Hey, Preston, you gonna help me take care of the babies today? Sorry, Bree. I got a lot of video. I mean, work. Yes, work. A lot of it. And uh, I promise you've got. Are, are you serious right now, Preston? Are you serious? Big Preston has left me alone with two little Prestons. Wah, 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 wah. I mean, I'm literally saying wah. They're gonna make me cry. Why are you crying, sir? I, I, I'm standing here. You shouldn't be sad. You know, you should be, you should be happy. Your mom is chilling with you today. Maybe they need some dance moves. Ooh, ooh, ooh! I'm a dancing Minecraft mom. Nope, that's not working. Can I tickle him? Nope, that does not work. Oh my goodness, they will not stop crying. They're probably hungry. That's easy to fix. Let's look up here. You know they're crying loud when I can hear them upstairs. Here we go. Baby formula, milk that can be fed to babies, baby bottles. But I actually need the legitimate milk. Good thing I have cows. This is the perfect explanation for why I have old Betsy the cow outside. Do, 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 Betsy the cow. Don't get outside. No, you're not allowed to leave. You are my cows. I feel like I need to get them a bigger barn. And why? Why are there two Betsies? I only remember them being one. I only remember one Betsy, but now they're copying the twins. It's neither here nor there. I need a bucket. Oh, I need two milks because I have two children. I forgot about that. Well, we're gonna leave. That's awkward. Thank you for your service. Now I just gotta mix it all together. Do to do, do like so. And done. Full bottle, bottle filled with baby formula. See, I keep forgetting. Now I have two. So it makes it doubly harder. Doubly the more work, doubly difficult. There you go. Guys, have you noticed in chat how many wins have been thrown my way? Guess in the comments how many you have seen because I think it's like 20 bajillion thousand at this point. I'm gonna lose my mind. Here you go, Preston one. Fed baby Preston one completed, yes. And baby Preston two. Ooh, that was a big burp I didn't even have to assist with. Babies are fed, you're welcome. They probably wanna have a book read to them. I remember when I was little, my mom read me books all the time. Let's see, Floopy the Slime Storybook. An adventurous adventure by Floopy the Slime. <sighs> Floopy can get kinda sticky. I think we need to get another one. Chuckles the Chicken Storybook. We're definitely gonna have to stick with that one because Chuckles will be sad if we don't read it. I don't even know how to sit because I have two of them to read to. Wait, you guys, I was literally just reading my book to the kids and then they immediately grew up and now they're running around in their underwear. What is happening? I thought babies were difficult, now they're toddlers. Where are they? Please don't go outside. Oh my goodness. Of course they went outside. They're so fast. Please stop, please. You're supposed to be babies still. Go inside right now. Okay, mommy, that's right, yeah. You better feel bad. We're sorry. I just realized that their name tags changed to Baby Preston 2 Diaper. Baby Preston 1 Diaper. That's a great nickname. Speaking of diapers, we need to cover those up. Let's get some clothes. Right here is the lovely wardrobe. I have a neon pink crown hoodie from RoyallyBee.com, as well as a rainbow Royally Bee black tee, as pictured on your screen. RoyallyBee.com, it'll make you fashionable. And it gives you five plus armor. I bestoweth upon you, Preston, one diaper, a neon crown. Oh, you look fabulous. And I bestoweth Preston two diaper with this shirt from RoyallyBee.com. They look fabulous. Now that me and the children are now not in diapers, that sounded embarrassing. It's time to start our day. As evidenced by the beautiful tennis ball in my inventory, we are going to be teaching the baby Prestons, that still sounds weird, Jerry and Terry, how to play catch today. 
We are going to play catch today. Yay, catch. Interesting, I've never played this with you, but I'm glad that you're confident. We're just gonna toss a rooski. Oh, oh, and he catches it. Yay, this is so fun. The anticipation, which Preston, Jerry, or Terry will lose first. Since they're having so much fun and they're enjoying their time, I'm gonna enjoy my time if I take a break. Not bad. I mean, they're fine. They're in the backyard. They have a tennis ball. Just gonna scooch a rooski on around. I'm just gonna quickly make a snack. That's all. It won't take long. Just need an empty glass. That's perfect for a refreshing drink. And a lemon. Perfect for lemonade, right? It's only good if it's freshly squeezed. Lemonade. Freshly squeezed. What is that? Oh my goodness. Why is the sound of TNT in my backyard? What is this? No! Hey! 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 Stop! Stop! Woo! I saw the light before my eyes. No fun? Really? Really? Do you know what's not fun? Is not knowing where your children got primed TNT. We have large problems at hand. You two have to go to timeout. Oh, uh, fine. Really? You are not allowed to give me sass, gentlemen. I am here at the beautiful grocery store with Jerry and Terry to buy some healthy snacks. Now, I hope they follow me. I can't really trust them. They've been a mess today. Hello, sir. Hey there, feel free to look around for whatever you need. Ah, he's so friendly. Now, I should have made a shopping list. Oh, Samuel, I love little old people. He's so cute. I could get a pumpkin. I definitely don't know what some of this produce is. I should probably eat healthier than I already do. Hmm. What's on the other side of the store? Oh my goodness, they have so much new and fresh produce. I can even buy, oh, what kind of fruit is this? It's pink. Sandy, what is this pink fruit? It's a berry, it's a blueberry. Astonished pumpkin, a pink berry. What was that? Oh my goodness, why is the store on fire? He burnt my broccoli, he burnt my shake, what? Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, we have to put this on. The clerk is on fire, Samuel, no, Samuel, no. I have to find water and water stat. Uh, uh, there is conveniently a fish tank. I am sorry to all the fish. I am going to steal your water source for my benefit before this whole place burns down. Oh, why didn't I start with Samuel? I definitely, Samuel, come here, sir. You look terrified and so am I. Oh, old person saved. Oh, Samuel is nice and dry. The store clerk is terrified on the counter. Who else is on fire? Oh, Sandy, you made it out alive. Oh no, this man is also on fire. I didn't even talk to you yet. Sir, it's all going to be okay. George, George from the jungle. Why did that water not work? Oh no, oh no, I'm delaying the inevitable. Oh, George. It's going to be okay. I put out all the fires. Now I probably should pick up some of the floods. I tried, it's not fully working. Ma'am, please take your children and go. <laughs> they almost burned down my entire store. <laughs> Th that's true, but I had nothing to do with it. Oh, this is humiliating. I was trying to make this their punishment and they punished me back. Guess it's time we go. Oh, I'm gonna have to come up with a better punishment. Yes, I know, I should be punishing them. However, we are stopping at the park because I need some fresh air. This has already been an insanely long day and Preston has not helped me at all. <gasps> oh, babies! Baby Leah, baby Jelly, Unspeakable, and Sunday, they're so cute! Hi, Bui, hi, Preston, OMG, hi, stop. We sound so cute. Do you mind if the twins play with you guys? We are playing hide and seek. I want to play. I don't know if he's saying he wants to play or they're allowed to play, but I think the boys will like this. Yay, you guys are the seekers. Count to 10, then come find us. Oh, I don't know if the babies were prepared for this, but they are very good seekers. 10, nine, seven, C, twee. Zero. Oh no, I need to teach them how to count. Oh, they're going. Oh, let's follow them. I just, I want to be a part of the game too. I'm not going to lie. They are sticking together. They are very big into teamwork, apparently. Where are they going? Where, where are they going? Oh, 
Oh, they're running fast. Running fast on to see. Why is that bush on fire? Baby Preston. All fire. Leah's in the bush. Oh my goodness, no. Poor thing. Boys. Hey, that wasn't okay. Let's find more. Yeah, they're so bad. They didn't even acknowledge that I was saying they were in trouble. Ooh, I'm gonna have to think of the good punishment. Comment down below what your least favorite punishment you've ever gotten was. Why are they looking up? Oh, oh no! Unspeakable was in the tree and they hit him with a fireball? OMG, fire bill. Oh, oh goodness. Yeah, you run away. These boys are up to no good. Where are they getting fireballs? Can we please just tag them next time? <laughs> Again, yay. Okay, thank you so much for ignoring me. I really appreciate that as your mother. Oh no, no, no. He's covering baby jelly with lava. How are they keeping this in their pockets? Oh goodness. Why is the entire courtyard filled with fire? Boys, I am coming for you. You are going to be punished. Also, we need a huge water bucket. Kids, I have talked multiple times about punishing these children that are being very bad, but we're in front of a pet store now on our way home. And so I can't resist. You guys want to go see the puppies? Yes, puppy. I, okay, I knew they would love this idea. Where are they going? Hey, I haven't shown you where the puppies are. <gasps> oh no, puppies are escaping. Help, get them. Boys, help get the puppies. They, they literally went directly to baby Terry and Jerry. I want to ride it. <gasps> Stop, are you kidding me? No, get back here. Oh my goodness. One, those things love the boys. And two, they're literally making them go farther away from the store. My dogs, they've escaped. <gasps> Sir, I'm very sorry. You look very derpy. You there, can you help me get them back? Here are some leads. Guys, please comment down below if you think the pet store owner is a bit derpy because I do, but I still love him. You guys, I'm on a mission. In order to retrieve both of the puppies, look under your video and if that subscription button's red, make it gray. I've got the first puppy. Woo! Let's bring him in. Baby Preston one, also known as Jerry. You're in big trouble. You can't even look at puppies and not get in trouble. Put him in here and close the door. Done. One puppy is back. <gasps> he was close. He was very close. <laughs> Did it. You think you can outrun your mother? I mean, a dog probably could. But th anyways, this is neither here nor there. Dogs returned. Oh, I'm very sorry for the trouble. Thank you for returning my dogs. There are some special kids you got there. It's probably best you guys run along. Oh my goodness, everyone hates baby Preston in one and two because they're bad. I have to teach them some manners. In order to make me happy, you have to assist me in baking today. Today we are going to be making a cookie dough cake. Can you boys help me fetch some ingredients? Yay, I'll get chocolate mm, eggs. Let's see it, let's see it. <gasps> Baby Preston won. Got me an egg and some wheat and sugar. Good job. Baby Preston two has the chocolate bar in his hand and he won't give it to me. Can I have the chocolate Preston two? He did not. He just took a huge chunk of a bite out of this chocolate bar. Look at it. Look at it in my inventory. It's gross. Heat kills germs. So we're just gonna put it in the furnace with some coal, melt it down. It'll be totally like it never happened. That looks very unappetizing. I'm not gonna say what I think that looks like, but apparently it is melted chocolate. I'm gonna make some lovely cookie dough here. Can be cooked to make a cake. And now all we have to do is bake it for a little bit. Now, what are you boys up to? What is in your hands? Let's play TNT Run. What is TNT Run? Why do you have mini TNT blocks? Sirs, sirs, where are you going? Oh my goodness, I lost them. Oh, they're in the front yard. What are they doing? Oh my goodness, our street is going to be gone. Hey, get back here. Get back here. Oh, I'm gonna take a lot of damage for this. Hey, you are too fast for me. Oh, you're in trouble. You're in trouble. Oh, I have picked up baby Preston too. And guys, I'm distracted because I picked him up, but he's levitating. This is hilarious. Oh, oh, hold on, Bree. Get the other twin. Come here, Preston one. I'm literally taking damage because of these kids. 
Pamir Preston won. I know you're gonna walk back this way. Finally have them both levitating in my hands. It's time we go back to the house so you can think about what you've done. Oh, it's time to relax. I honestly have no clue where my kids are. Like literally no clue at all. Fire alarm triggered. You burnt the cake off. Wait, where are the boys? Oh no, where are the boys? Oh, I have to make a run for it. What is this? What is this? How are they on the roof? They literally have flint and steel in their hands. Yay, mommy is burning stuff with us. Burn down the house. Oh my goodness. I have to get you down from there. Old Betsy the cow is good for a lot of things, including I gave her some fire resistance potions to keep safe in the backyard. Burn down the house. Absolutely not. I'm going to bring you down the side of the house. Come on, Betsy. Help me out, Mrs. Cow. No, don't. Don't leave. I need you potion of fire resistance. Thank goodness it's for eight minutes because I think this may last a while. Bye, Betsy. One and two. I will come back for you. Now, all I have to do is drink this and I can go up the lava. Just like you go up a waterfall, we're just gonna go up the lava on the side of my house. Totally normal occasion. Perfect. I'm on fire, but I'm resistant. Oh, and there's another stream on the side of the house. Oh, I'm here. They literally have rotten flesh? Why? I will ask later. Take this. Seriously? You're just gonna run down without me? Oh my goodness. I don't want this in my inventory. This is as graceful as I can be even though I am on fire. They're going into the street. Incoming call from Preston. So now you call, huh? Preston, you will not believe all the chaos that the boys have caused today. Just come on down to the gaming lounge. I mean, office, and we can talk about it. Okay, boys, it is finally time to see your dad. What is in your hand? Why is there coffee in your hand? Mommy, look what we got. Me too. Why are you? Where did they get coffee from? Caffeine? Oh, gosh. They are on a rampage. Ah, they're destroying the town. Preston and I are going to have triplets in Minecraft today. You heard me. You, you heard me. In Minecraft today. Don't, don't get any crazy ideas. First of all, I have to find my children. Oh, no. I feel like a terrible bear. I literally have no idea. There's three name tags downstairs. Okay, I left the children downstairs. What? I have so many questions. Okay, baby status, happy, probably because she looks like her mom. I, I'm playing, but I mean, she does. And also she has no legs. Are you okay? <laughs> then we have baby number two, Preston. You look just like baby Preston and the real Preston, but he's a different one. Goodness, this is gonna be a rough day. <gasps> oh, and then we have another one that looks like me and she is happy. They're all happy and in bed standing. Having three children has already exhausted me and I just started this process in Minecraft. Oh, we have status bars of each each baby, you need a pink tulip. Hold on, I was just about to get in bed. I have no idea where their father is, and now they but why do you need a pink tulip and a diamond? These babies are bougie. Oh goodness, it's like a timer. What's gonna happen if it runs out? Let's look. Oh my goodness. Well, this must be where the child items, yes. The child needs the diamond, so it makes sense now. I had stored their belongings in this huge wall of chests. Now I need to find tulips. We have gold, we have a tulip, a diamond. I only need one more, one more, or they have to fight for it between themselves. You know, start the sharing process as early as possible. Are you walking? These are newborn children and they are just lollygagging in my huge vault of, wow. Okay, here you go. What was that? Oh! My gosh, I was trying to give you what you wanted here. <sighs> this is terrible behavior. Okay, I was giving you a tulip when you wanted the diamond. That is one greedy baby. Why are you over here all alone? Have a tulip. I have randomly been given a yellow rocket ship, a cute little green teddy, and this ginormous orange dog. Why is this so much bigger than everything? That's creepy. Okay, so we are going to start with baby number one. She has a green name tag, so I'm going to think she likes green. First, I'm going to give her the teddy bear like a good parent would. And then let's see, maybe she wants me to paint her room. I don't know. 
Uh, green, okay. And then how about the walls? Oh, oh, okay. How does this, I wish this happened in real life. Baby room decorated. Tanks, mommies, I love the teddy bear. You're welcome. I have actually been a parent twice already in Minecraft, so I, I know what I'm doing. Guys, comment down below what we should name these triplets. Baby two, you apparently like yellow. You look like Preston and his favorite color is orange, but I won't hold that against you. We're gonna go yellow and there we go. Pew, pew, boom, rocket ship. You're welcome. I, I don't know if that was a thank you, but I'm gonna take it. We have an orange doll. I guess this is orange. I. Pfft. That doesn't look orange to me. Oh my goodness. Hold, hold up, guys. This thing is terrifying. Look at it. Are those her eyeballs? It's fine as long as the child likes it, but that literally terrifies me. Okay, orange, orange, orange. Here we go. Here we go. Look at that fashion sense. This doll is so... Hold on. We don't like walls. We want to live together. Okay, first of all, guys, you are newborn children. Why do you have explosives? And number two, I would have helped you guys with this. Why don't you believe in me? I have to figure out what their first punishment will be. You will get punished if you don't look below this video and hit that subscription button. I'll be very offended. I have gathered you all here today. <laughs> To let you know, we are about to go to grandma's house. We ones do any things, I promise. We will sit tight until you get back. I was not suspicious until they said, I promise that I won't do anything. Now I'm a little sketched out and you seem like you have an evil plot, but it's fine. I'm gonna be really fast and grab some things from my closet. Welcome to my master bedroom. We have baby food, only one for the triplets. It's fine. A candy bar, start it off early. Make them know chocolate is good. We have a fresh diaper. Ew, why is it called a fresh diaper? Just call it like a clean diaper or just a diaper. I, I That's too much imagery for me. I have everything I need one of you gets each item what are you doing mess it all up <clears throat> you realize i can see you you have thrown the flowers that i politely gave you why did i say let's have three children in minecraft i am i'm very quickly regretting this where is that vacuum cleaner here we go that's aggressive that is a super sucker i mean it is like oh it's intense it kind of sounds like a ender dragon flapping his wings now that I've finished cleaning, I'm going to discipline the children. How do I keep losing these kids? They're literally not even supposed to be walking yet. Oh, okay, I, I can see their name tags. This is beneficial. Why are you hiding from me? This is not hide and seek. Get, come here. Sir, I'm about to find you. <gasps> yes. You are just out in the open, baby number one. Come here. Whoa, I just got teleported up here. All babies caught. Yes, I know, because I just caught them all. I didn't need to be told what I already know. It's time to go, and I didn't mean to put it in all caps, but I am technically yelling right now. Gamma's house smells bad. No, we want go to beach. I don't know what grandma they're talking about because they've never been to the grandma's house yet. Help me, boy. First of all, I am mom. Don't call me by my first name and perfect i already have a child screaming for help they're the ones who wanted to go to the beach oh gosh oh gosh how did you get in here there are dolphins surrounding her honestly i would like to stay in there if i was her okay let's get something to distract the dolphins we all know if we get a salmon up in there they will definitely fight and get away from the child so there's a vacuum cleaner because of course everyone, first thing you pack on your way to the beach is a vacuum. You hate when sand gets in your toes. Raw salmon, perfect. Da, 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 da. I'm going to help her. I am running as fast as possible. I know I'm a little slow here, but here you go, ma'ams and sirs. Oh, okay. Okay, well, for some reason that made them literally bust out the side of the pond. Now, did you have anything in your pocket that might have like attracted them to uh, trap you? I don't know why they were following me. That sounds suspicious. Are you sure though? It's just these things. She just dropped three raw salmon. So either she didn't know or she was up to something. Comment down below what you think. Well. Now that you've caused a ton of trouble, go and sit with your siblings, get out of the ocean, get away from the dolphins. Thank you for minding. Uh, mommies, the odor babies aren't here. What? 
Okay, first of all, you got trapped in the ocean with dolphins, and now I've lost the other two children on the beach somewhere. Okay, I'm for sure gonna find their name tags. I bet they're under a cabana. They are not under a cabana. Perfect. Maybe over here. I still don't see their name tags anywhere. This is a horrible nightmare. I'll tell you one thing. You never want to lose a child near the beach, near the ocean. This is not good. Is this a house? This is the fanciest sandcastle display I have seen in my entire life. This is glorious. They've got to be here. I mean, that one even has a garage. Oh, no. Okay. Yeah. What did I say? I knew they were here. You literally exploded a masterpiece. What? <laughs> This is our castle now. Stay away, Brianna's. You can't beat us if you tried. You know what? If they think it's indestructible, there was a vacuum cleaner in our cabana chest. My intuition knew that these children would cause a problem. Just gonna hurry on over here. I'm very glad there aren't other people at the beach today because I would be very embarrassed. <gasps> what? We this isn't fair. Oh, it's... You're cheating. Guys, I literally had no idea the power of this vacuum, but please don't fall to your death. But uh, I would like you to get out of here as soon as possible. Oh, come on, come on, kids. Get, get out of this thing. I'm gonna find you. I'm gonna make you get out of the sandcastle one way or another. I don't feel like this vacuum should be legal because it is so strong. I'm gonna teach you to, to respect your mother. Yet again, where is Preston? My children are levitating. Whose kids are these? I, this is very strange. Okay, here we are at the candy store and literally, how do they know where this is? And they are outrunning me. Please don't cause havoc in the store. I am so embarrassed. Yes, Aria, why are you hitting me with an ax? Catch all the kids. You need to get a hold of your kids right now. The longer you wait, the more I'll charge you. I'm timing you. Excuse me, Aria, I thought we were friends. I'm offended. You hit me with an ax and then now you're charging me money. Oh my gosh, why am I so slow? Why do you have slime on the floor, Aria? I thought you wanted me to catch the children. Oh my gosh, oh, come here. Come, potato, get back here. It's fine. I'm going to get you if it's the last thing I do, potato. You're not even moving at all. This is convenient for me. Oh, it's still potato. Okay, that was not exciting. But hey, hey, I, I see you, whatever your name is. Baby three, I see, oh, I see baby three. Come back here, come back here. Hey, hey, I'm not as fast as you. Shh, shh, gotta be really sneaky. Please, yes. Now I have all babies caught. I only caught two. What is, uh-oh. Okay, you don't have to pay. That looked really hard. Just so you know, though, you would have owed me $2,880. Don't let this happen again. I'll let the kids go. To the zoo, I ate so much cake. First of all, the floor has disappeared from under my feet. My children are leaving to another public place. And Arya, I don't think we can be friends. I'm honestly pretty pumped for the zoo, though. We are finally here at the zoo and they are very excited. I am as well. I love animals. So we have made it to the ticket counter. Hello, Nathan and receptionist. Y'all need to sit tight while I buy the tickets, okay? We won't go anywheres. Potato, I have learned not to trust you. I would like four tickets, please. And how many tickets will that be? Nathan, I just said four. And why do you need that many tickets for just yourself? First of all, that's very nosy. And I have three children behind me. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I can't pay you right now. I have to find my children. What are you doing? First of all, this zoo only features sheep, cows, and pigs so far. And my children have let them free and are riding each animal. Animal. You know what? Come here, potato. Get off the animals. It wasn't us, I swear. Wait, there's no way anyone else let the animals escape. You are the only toddlers in here. Put all the animals back, please. That sounds fun. Let's go. It's fun to put the animals back. But I kind of agree because we're getting to be with all of them. But excuse me. Why are those two pigs connected? They, they're literally morphing into one large animal. Does the cow belong in the water? This is so chaotic. It's okay, cow. We will get through this together. At least they are kind of mine. They can be good when they want to be. I am exhausted. You made me chase after you constantly today. But how did you like today? You've never actually explored the town before. My favorite part was the candy. My favorite part was the beach. My favorite part was the part where you didn't name me. I'm feeling some resentment here, baby number three. Your name will be decided later. I believe in positivity and you need some positive criticism versus negative. So I'm just going to say thank you for behaving. It was horrible, but I'm going 
to encourage them to act better. What? Hello? Why did you throw a potion at me? I am walking like a grandma speed. Don't you realize I can catch you? This is revenge for not naming me. I was right. Baby number three hates me. Guys, I need your help. Prestian, that was a horrible hiding spot. I still love you though. Baby number three, I'm catching you second. And uh, I really appreciate that you guys really aren't running around. You're just uh, staying there for me. All kids have been caught and it is time to go home. I am never complimenting you again. Okay, we are home and Potato is ready to take a bath. We, I have a surprise for you. Oh, I love surprises. I'm ready. I'm ready. Two, one. What is it? What, what is, are you kidding me? You look like baby Preston and you're acting like him. Who explodes the house and just showers you with potatoes? He obviously is taken after his name. I have a lot of cleaning up to do. Y'all have a blessed day. I will see you in my next video and check out one of the next two videos YouTube is suggesting you.